Happiness was achieving my goals. I was president of my class. I was an English major. I ran our literary festival, graduated magna cum laude. I did a speech on graduation. When I was nine years old, I decided I wanted to go to Duke. Getting in was one of the best moments of my life. I wanted to be a lawyer, so I applied to 10 law schools, Yale and Harvard and Stanford and a bunch of others. I got into all 10 of them. I got married two weeks after taking the bar exam and started my life at my dream law firm, which is O'Melveny and Myers. I mean, I remember getting tears in my eyes, thinking this is exactly what I want to do. I love this life. I love it. Happiness was being a mover and a shaker and kicking ass. This is where I'm supposed to be, and I'm achieving what I need to achieve, and that is happiness, and I was fulfilled then. And, um, and then I got sick. Diagnosed September 19, 2010. She said, the cancer is very aggressive. I would never practice law again. I'd never play basketball. I would be in pain and I would die in a year, two years at most. And I said, well, I'm aggressive, so let's go. I was never upset. I never said, why me? I'm 28 years old, why me? I didn't give a shit about any of that. I was gonna go for it and beat the hell out of it and have a great time doing it. And I was psyched to show myself and my family and my friends what I was made of. And I was psyched to beat the shit out of cancer. So it wasn't a bad day for me. I just thought of Rocky and I'm just like, when can I get out of this hospital and start pounding some sides of meat and running up the stairs? I'm not afraid of death. I'm not afraid of its sickness. I'm not afraid of any of those big things. When fear drops away, fear of failure, of the unknown, fear that comes from a lack of self-confidence. I just live and choose the things that I want. You know, I went cage diving, great white sharks. I wasn't afraid. Going after the things that we want with a, with a pure heart and a pure focus shouldn't bother other people. And if it does, that's probably their, their hang up. I don't have 80 years guaranteed and neither do you and neither does anyone. So make the most out of your life right now. Recognize what brings you joy. Go get it. Go get as much of it as possible.